welcome blissful navaratras for each one of us these are transcendental days these are the days of blissful learning we are continuing learning ganita sutras to teach them to teach their values we are learning values of ganita sutras to teach these values the text of ganita sutras and of sutras is a composition of devanagari alphabet letters ganita sutras avail 283 letters while ganita up sutras avail 236 letters the combined integrated text of ganita sutras and up sutras of the range of 519 letters in all as we have seen during the previous session that the first step in this direction is to memorize this text then we shall with complete imprint of this text in our mind the same can be recited as a prayer the opening prayer of vedic mathematics class the vedic mathematics lessons vedic mathematics classes are also to be closed by reciting the vedic mathematics prayer is the text of ganita sutras and sutras beginning with ekadi ken purve and reaching up till gunit samuchya samuchya gunita these 29 sutras and sutras make a complete prayer one can recite this prayer in a few minutes the bliss of the vibrations of the sounds of this text is of immense levels each one of us will be benefited by the vibrations of the sounds of this text and it all will depend as to degree of the transcendental reach of one's mind mind creates its own intelligence field the intelligence field created by mind is of inherent potentialities parallel to the potentialities of the organization format of ganita sutras and up sutras and with it the intelligence field gets properly formatted along consciousness foundation the consciousness is of different states and the vibrations of the sounds of the text of ganita sutras and up sutras go parallel with the impulses of consciousness therefore it is this unison field of the consciousness impulses and the vibrations of the sounds of the text of ganita sutras and up sutras which makes it a transcendental phenomenon the transcendental phenomenon of vedic mathematical domain the proper appreciation of this organizational foundation of the format features of the text of ganita sutras and sutras take us to the format of devanagari varanamala devanagari alphabet 
as well is of organization formatted features parallel with the aggregation format features Ganita Sutras themselves. The ECV values of the letters, 42 letters of Devanagari alphabet together with that of Devanagari formulation or Nala formulation itself is parallel with the total letters 283 of the text of Ganita Sutra. This way, Devanagari alphabet format and Ganita Sutra formats run parallel to each other. It is the script, it is the sequential organization, it is the placement values of the sequential organizations of different classes, letters as vowels, varga consonants, anthasta letters, uchna letters, that the Vedic mathematical domain starts unfolding. The first letter of the text of Vinita Sutras is sixth vowel. Being the sixth vowel, it has PC value six. And it will be blissful to take note that the frequency of occurrence of the first letter, that is the sixth vowel, in the total range of 519 letters is 1. The text of Vinita Sutras, the range of 283 letters, is having occurrence of first letter, sixth vowel, six time, nine times. And this nine times frequency occurrence of the first letter text of 16 Gita Sutras dictated to 6 only. Sutra 1 has repeated occurrence of the first letter, 6th vowel, so it has frequency 2. Sutra 4 has once, Sutra 5 as well as once, Sutra 6 as well as once, and Sutra 11 is having repeated Likewise, Sutra 13 as well as the repeated occurrence of the letter, the sixth vowel. These six sutras, that is, first, fourth, fifth, sixth, and thirteenth, have the occurrence of the the total frequency of occurrence of the first letter in the sutras is nine. Likewise, the total occurrence of first letter is 12. This together takes us to grand total value of 9 plus 12 is 1. And we know that this frequency 21 of TC value 6 takes us to total TC value of total occurrence of the first vowel in the entire text of Sutras and of Sutras comes to 120. One shall sit comfortably and permit the mind to be parallel with this organization for its particularly in respect of its very first letter the vowel. This, this way brings us face to face with the depth, intensity of the organization format. There are 16 sutras. No, Value 16 as PC value 16 or as 16 domain, that is domain of hypercube 16 will lead us to 
domain split spectrum as value 16 having a split as a pair of values 14 and then the transcendence to dimension of dimension level will lead to value 12. The 16, 14, 14 and 12 together make value 56. However, we know that a raised power n to 2 and b raised power n is the domain boundary ratio of the hypercubes. Therefore, it will take us to value 8, 7, 7 and 6 for 16, 14, 14 and 12. Summation value 8 plus 7 plus 7 plus 6 plus 8. Value 28 is parallel to the TC value of formulation Brahma. Here it is written Brahm. So it is of value Brahm. The value 28 is the gaps value of 29 points range. 29 discrete points lead to 28 gaps. We are having 29 sutras, 16 sutras and 13 sutras together. Now, these 29 sutras as 29 discrete points of range will lead to 28 gaps. Now, it is this value which will further bring us face to face with the 16 plus 14 plus 14 plus 14. Now, let us comfortably be face to face with this pair of values 28 and 56. Now, if we have numbers 1 to 28, and if we compute the factors numbers 1 to 28, it will come to be 56. It is very, very blissful. State numbers range 1 to 28 leading to 50 factors. Now, it is this feature which deserves to be comprehended well to have proper appreciation of the mathematical domain of Ganita Sutra. It is here itself it would be relevant to take note that. Values range 1 to 16 leads us to 29 factors. So, value 16 and 16 sutras. Value 16 has 2 raised per 4 parallel with the value of the dimensional frame of quadruple spatial dimensions of 4 space. All these features, as these are, bring us face to face with the inherent potentialities of this organization format of the text of Gita Sutras and of Sutras. Step ahead. When we are having a focus on distinct letters of the text of Sutras, then we will see that 16 sutras are having only 31 distinct letters and 13 upsutras text is having 33 distinct letters. 31 plus 33 becomes 64 and the distinct letters of the combined text of the sutras and upsutras comes to 36. 64 plus 36 is 100. 100 gives us a split 50 plus 50. And then 50 also gives us a split of 36 plus 14. 14 is the submission value of quadruple folds 2, 3, 4, 5 of hypercube 4. Therefore, this organization 
has a distinct letter of sutras and upasutras or one which has a total integrated format. Now, value 64 is the value of the TCV values of the first letters of all the 16 sutras. Sutra 1 to Sutra 16. If we arrange these 16 letters and reach at the TC values, it will come to be 4. And further, we know value 36, the value of TC value formulation Paranava. Tasse Vachka Paranava. Om, Om Iti Ekakshar Gram. All syllable Om unfolds itself as a Paranava. Now, this is one feature of the organization. Now see, we have observed that the first letter, the text, that is the sixth vowel, is having a total frequency of occurrence in the text of Sutra Sutra being 21. And the TCV value of this 21 times occurrence of the first vowel as of this value 6 takes us to value 126. Now see, value 6 takes us to hypercube 6, the representative regular body of 6 space. Value 6 as hypercube 6 takes us to format of a Surya. Therefore, 6 space as a self-referral space is presided by Lord Vishnu. Lord Vishnu is the overlord of six space. Shri Vishnu Puran is the scripture which is of six ansh, six parts, six components, and all six ansh are having a total range of 126. A glimpse of it, we can be face to face with the table as the Anch 1 is having 22 chapters. You see, value 22 is the station value of 4 folds 4, 5, 6, 7 of hypercube 6. The chapter 2, Anch 2, is of the range of 16 chapters. And value 16 is the value of the dimensional frame of the creator space and fourth space. Further have a pause here and take note that the second letter of the Ganita Sutra is Ka, Ka Brahma, the overlord of fourth space. So, second letter takes us to the creator of the space, which is having a dimensional frame of value 16. A chapter A Aisha 3 is of the range of 18 chapters. And we see the reach up till 18 as such is of value 56. As we have seen, the values 1 to 28 lead to value 56. And value 28 is a TC value of a Brahm. The step ahead, the value is 24 for the fourth Ansh has 24 chapters. And value 24, we know is value of six creative dimensions of six. The head is value 38, which is 19 plus 19. And we know 16 as dimension takes us to 19 as origin. And within creator space, which is of a spatial order, it will take us to value 38. Finally, the last six tons is Eight chapters range, and the total range comes to 126. Therefore, the mathematical domain, mathematical processes, organization format features of the text of Vedanta Sutras and Sutras, its mathematical processes, its mathematics, is the mathematics which takes us to the organization format features 
and knowledge of Shri Vishnu Pura. Therefore, this sadhaka fulfilled with intensity of earth to be parallel with mathematical processes, mathematical steps, mathematical domain for its pure and applied values shall be through it and be parallel with the organization features in respect of each and every distinct letter. There are 36 distinct letters. The first distinct letter is A, the sixth vowel, a value six, the first fact number value, the value which takes us to hypercube six, value which takes us to one Surya as a six space body. Therefore, this mathematic which we are glimpsing deserves to be imbibed fully. Sadhakas fulfilled with the intensity of urge to be parallel with the mathematical domain of Ganita Sutras shall approach Sutras, the Sutras way. The organization of the Sutra is inherently capable of unfolding its own potentialities, its own processes, its own reach. Now, it is with this learning only we can make ourselves act by the mathematics teachers. So, our learning approach to the mathematical domain, mathematical processes, Vita Sutras shall be with an aim that we become perfect Vedic mathematics. For it, naturally, the innocence mind of the young people and the perfect mind of the perfect Vedic mathematics teachers have to interact. Now, the art to be learned is how to communicate with innocence minds. And it is here where the Ganita Sutra take us to Vishnu Shahistarnam Stotram. There are 1000 self-referral formulations of six domain. It is by reciting these formulations it is by imbibing the vibrations of the sounds of these 1000 self referral formulations for Vishnu that one shall be perfecting one's own intelligence. It is with the perfection of one's intelligence, with having proper formatting along the consciousness foundations, that we shall be our intelligence. A step ahead, the reach is going to be that the entire chase as such is to be a chase along the format of hypercube. Hypercube 6, the representative or regular body of 6 is, is of 13 versions. We know that the first letter, sixth vowel, is having TC value 6. Last vowel, last letter, is Visarjini of TC value 13. Therefore, while we will be through this format of Ganita's medical domain, we shall be sequentially having a reach from the TC value of the first letter to the the last this would mean that this is going to be a properly formatted setup of paper cube of 13 versions. These 13 versions of paper cube 6 are the representative regular bodies of 6. This as such will ultimately settle for us 
a miring rod, a synthetic setup of hypercore one to six, which is of the potentialities of speaking, swapping six space domain. Once we will be parallel to this swapping process, six space domain in terms of sthapatra miring rod, we will be satisfied as that we are along the path of our mate. So learning and teaching of Vedic mathematics, mathematics of Vedic Sutras is ultimately going to be the base of the existence phenomenon of the solar universe along Hypercube six as a domain swept by Stapatya Mering Rod synthesized by Hypercube one to six. Thank you very much.